Getting to the heart of homelessness and how to end it were front and center during this roundtable discussion led by West Palm Beach Mayor Keith James. I'm just going to throw this out there. Panelists from nonprofits that help the unhoused, the county, as well as the city's own social services supervisor gave their perspectives from the root cause of homelessness. The reason people are homeless is they are without a home. They may have vulnerabilities that make them more apt to be the individual or household that becomes homeless, but those are vulnerabilities. Those are not causes. To how to help those who are chronically homeless, many of them suffering from substance abuse and mental health issues. Most of our people that we deal with do suffer from serious disabilities. 62 year old Connie Miller, who attended the roundtable, has gotten help from the city's homeless outreach team, but she hasn't always been willing to accept that help, even though she's been on the streets for several years. So I was pretty much pushed out of affordable housing because my SSDI for physical disability, degenerative disease, does not uh, cover rent. So you don't have enough money with your... I don't have enough income. Balancing the rights of people like Connie who are experiencing homelessness with concerns of residents, visitors, and business people has always been a hot-button issue, and it was taken up during the roundtable. They just don't want to be confronted with homeless encampments. Panelists agreed that building more low-income housing in pricey South Florida will help. West Palm Beach and Palm Beach County have made strides in that area, but with 700 people on the county's waiting list for transitional housing, it's clear there is much more work to be done. Mayor James says they'll talk about some possible solutions during the next roundtable discussion. This is Cheryl Kahn reporting for WPB-TV.